What is slope stability? Slope stability refers to the ability of a slope or an inclined surface to resist the forces that cause it to collapse or fail. It is an important topic in geotechnical engineering and earth sciences as it affects natural and man-made slopes, such as hills, mountains, cliffs, and excavations. The stability of a slope is influenced by several factors such as the slope angle, the nature and properties of the soil or rock, the presence of water, and external loads such as earthquakes, construction activities, and erosion. When these factors exceed the limit of stability, the slope may undergo different types of failure, such as slides, slumps, rockfalls, and debris flows. The study of slope stability involves the assessment of the potential risk and the evaluation of the existing or proposed slopes. Geotechnical engineers and geologists use different methods to measure and analyze slope stability, including field observations, laboratory tests, and numerical modeling. Field observations involve the visual inspection of the slope and its surroundings, and the identification of potential instability indicators such as cracks, bulges, and soil erosion. Laboratory tests include the analysis of soil or rock samples to determine their physical and mechanical properties, such as shear strength, permeability, and deformation characteristics. Numerical modeling involves the use of computer programs to simulate the behavior of the slope under different conditions and to predict the risk of failure. Several techniques can be used to improve slope stability, depending on the specific conditions and causes of instability. Some of these techniques include Slope flattening, reducing the slope angle to decrease the gravitational forces acting on the slope. Drainage, improving the drainage system to reduce the amount of water that infiltrates into the slope and decreases its stability. Reinforcement, adding structural elements such as soil nails, anchors, and retaining walls to increase the slope's resistance to external loads. Vegetation, planting vegetation on the slope to increase the cohesion and root reinforcement of the soil. In conclusion, slope stability is an important aspect of geotechnical engineering and earth sciences that aims to ensure the safety and stability of slopes and inclined surfaces. By understanding the factors that influence slope stability and implementing appropriate measures to improve it, we can prevent potential disasters and protect lives and properties. Why is slope stability important? Slope stability is an important aspect of geotechnical engineering and earth sciences due to its significant impact on human activities and the environment. The stability of slopes, hills, and mountains affects various natural and man-made structures, such as roads, railways, buildings, dams, and mines, as well as ecosystems and landscapes. One of the primary reasons why slope stability is important is because slope failures can cause significant damage and loss of life. Landslides, rockfalls, and debris flows can occur suddenly and without warning, causing severe damage to buildings, infrastructure, and natural habitats, as well as leading to fatalities and injuries. Therefore, it is crucial to assess and manage the risk of slope failure to prevent potential disasters and protect lives and properties. In addition to the safety concerns, slope stability is also important for sustainable development and land use planning. The stability of slopes affects the feasibility and cost of infrastructure projects, such as roads, bridges, and tunnels, and can limit the development potential of certain areas. Moreover, slope stability is crucial for the preservation of natural ecosystems and landscapes, which are important for biodiversity, soil and water conservation, and cultural heritage. Furthermore, slope stability is affected by various natural and human-induced factors, such as climate change, urbanization, and land use change. The increasing frequency and intensity of extreme weather events, such as heavy rainfall and droughts, can affect slope stability by altering the water balance and triggering landslides and erosion. Urbanization and land use change can also affect slope stability by altering the natural drainage patterns, increasing the surface runoff, 
and altering the soil properties and vegetation cover. To address these challenges and ensure slope stability, geotechnical engineers and geologists use various methods to measure, analyze, and improve slope stability. These include field observations, laboratory tests, and numerical modeling, as well as different slope stabilization techniques such as slope flattening, reinforcement, drainage, and vegetation. By implementing appropriate measures to manage the risk of slope failure and promote sustainable land use, we can ensure the safety and stability of slopes and promote sustainable development. How is slope stability measured? Slope stability is measured and analyzed using various methods, including field observations, laboratory tests, and numerical modeling. The choice of method depends on the specific conditions and objectives of the slope stability assessment. Field observations are an essential part of slope stability assessment, as they allow geotechnical engineers and geologists to visually inspect the slope and its surroundings and identify potential instability indicators. These may include cracks, bulges, soil erosion, and vegetation patterns. Field measurements may also involve collecting samples of soil or rock to analyze their physical and mechanical properties in the laboratory. Laboratory tests are used to determine the physical and mechanical properties of soil and rock samples, which are essential for slope stability analysis and design. These tests may include triaxial shear tests, direct shear tests, permeability tests, and consolidation tests. The results of these tests can be used to determine the shear strength, deformation characteristics, and permeability of the soil or rock, which are essential parameters for slope stability analysis. Numerical modeling is a powerful tool for slope stability analysis, as it allows geotechnical engineers and geologists to simulate the behavior of the slope under different conditions and predict the risk of failure. Numerical modeling involves the use of computer programs that use mathematical models to simulate the deformation and failure behavior of the slope. These models can take into account different factors, such as the slope geometry, soil or rock properties, water content, and external loads. Some of the commonly used numerical modeling methods for slope stability analysis include finite element method, FEM, finite difference method, FDM, and distinct element method, DEM. There are different types of slope stability analysis methods, including limit equilibrium methods, finite element methods, and numerical modeling. Limit equilibrium methods are based on the assumption that the slope fails when the forces acting on it exceed the resisting forces. These methods are commonly used for simple slope geometries and can provide quick and efficient solutions. Finite element methods use numerical modeling to solve the equations governing the behavior of the slope. These methods can provide more detailed and accurate solutions but require more computational resources and expertise. Numerical modeling methods can provide detailed and accurate solutions for complex slope geometries and conditions, but require advanced computational skills and input data. In conclusion, slope stability measurement involves a combination of field observations, laboratory tests, and numerical modeling methods. These methods are used to assess the stability of slopes, identify potential risk factors, and design appropriate measures to improve slope stability and prevent potential disasters. By combining these methods, geotechnical engineers and geologists can ensure the safety and stability of slopes and promote sustainable development. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications.